What's going on guys? Welcome back here with another episode of Lip Ripping Outdoors. Today we're back out here once again in the gorgeous Utah mountains. It is fall time right now. All the quakies are changing colors. The air is nice and crisp. Super cold. I've already seen a few fish surfacing down here. I've actually never fished this reservoir open water before. I've only ice fished it but um, there's a few lakes in the general vicinity here that we will probably be fishing today loaded with tiger trout, maybe some cutthroat trout, but we're gonna get our rods all geared up, get down to the water, and hopefully we start uh, catching some trout. Let's get to it. Dude, there's a bunch of like uh, shells from snails on the shore. Yeah, a bunch of these style. Yeah, well, I uh, actually caught a trout through the ice last year at a reservoir up north that had uh, that in its gut. Yeah, they eat those snails. I wonder if I should just done lures. You're throwing the HD trout? Yeah. All right, <clears throat> starting things out here. I'm going to be throwing a homemade uh, marabou jig here. 10 pound braided line to a six pound fluorocarbon leader. Ooh, follower, follower. Yeah. I don't know. Looks like a cutthroat, to be honest. About 16 inches, maybe 17. Can you see that one? That's got to be a tiger. It's got a big old hump. Yeah. Well, it's got a big old hump back in it. Ooh. Eat it, you old sucker. Oh. oh, dude. Yeah. No. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Red kokanee. Kokanee. Little guy. All the way up here. Come here, you little son of a... I saw you chasing this. You want to eat that? Yeah. Yeah, you do. It's a buck. Oh, he bit it. He bit it. Hold on. I'm going to catch this guy. Oh, uh, he got pricked in the mouth. Now he won't bite it. 10, 11. Fish, fish, fish. Yeah, I thought I felt a bite on my when I just twitched it right before, but I didn't have the fish. I think it's another kokanee. I think so. Can't tell in the bright. No, it's a, it's a it's a uh, cutthroat. Cutthroat. There we are. First blood. Yeah. A little cutthroat. The sun was right in my eyes, and I couldn't tell if I I thought he might have been that kokanee because I saw it swim out over there. Get this guy unhooked. And we'll send him on his way. See you, buddy. Whew. Is that a bear river? Oh, there's one. Tiger, tiger, tiger. Hit it on the drop. Uh... Sure, actually, I'd love a net. That's a good fish. Yeah, it's not not a bad fish at all there. Look how pretty he is. Heck yeah, all right, I'll take the net. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, not a bad fish at all there. Oh, she's got some teeth on her. Yeah. Okay, yep, she's unhooked now. Big, beautiful tiger trout there. Gorgeous. Yeah, she's pretty solid unit there. Wow. I like to keep some fish today, but not this one. Yeah. This one's just big and beautiful. There she goes. Cha-ching! I already have... The Did it hit the other shoreline? Yeah. How did that happen? I don't know. 
I don't know. What the? It's on the other shoreline, huh? It, yeah, it thumped on the dirt. I don't think that's worth going and saving, though. Alrighty, well, after that unfortunate event of losing that one jig, now we've got a different hand-tied one, green body and the white tail. Hopefully we don't uh, give this one the same fate as the last one. Holy, Shh, Evan, hold on, hold on. Okay, it's not, it hasn't spooked. Okay, good. Oh, there it goes, did you see it? Oh, it's looking at my jig, it's looking at my jig. Giant tiger, giant tiger. Look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him. Stop moving, stop moving, stop moving. See how huge that fish is? Oh, he had it, he had it, he had it. Dude, that thing's ginormous. You don't willingly try to eat it. Holy shoot, he actually bit my jig. I messed up, did you see that? Oh my gosh. Dude, I thought he was spooking. I just had a good one follow me right here. Not that big. Yeah, not that big. Oh my gosh, that would have been my biggest tiger ever. I was literally a split second thing. Oh, oh, he's. He's on mine again. Got him, got him. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yeah, go get the net. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm just, just. Be fast, please. Oh my gosh. I don't know if this is the same big one or if it's the one that Evan had following him. Oh, it's a really good tiger shot though. Please don't come off, buddy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Shoot, dude. Dude. <laughs> Thanks for the net. <laughs> 20 and a half, maybe? 20 and a quarter. 20, 20 and a quarter. <sighs> stud, stud, stud. Yeah, I definitely think this isn't that first one. No. That first one looked bigger, actually. It, it did. That first one looked huge. Yeah. That first one was over. That one. This is still a really good fish. All right. We're keeping this big girl in the water here, so she should be fresh, ready to go. Take one good close-up look at her. Gorgeous freaking fish. All right, let's get her back in the drink. Oh, dude, she's so thick. That is one oh, yeah. tiger trout. See you later, big girl. Sweet, dude. Thanks for the net. Yeah. And even though it's a solid fish. Only like two pounds, two and a quarter pounds. Really? Yeah. Wow. There's one. Okay. 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 Okay, buddy. Yeah. Okay, buddy. Probably. Okay, buddy. What are you? I don't, it almost feels like I snagged something. I did. It's a, it's a trout. I got a cutthroat on the side. I, uh, Evan, I don't, I don't need the net. Yeah, it's a cutthroat on the side. This doesn't count as a catch. Yeah, this happens a lot when I fish, like, jigs and stuff. Well, not a lot, but like, it happened to me with the rainbow recently. Uh, sometimes it happens to me with salmon, but these fish will come up and check out your jig out of curiosity. Yeah, well, they end up getting hooked in the side. Uh, I need to step over here. You couldn't have just bit it? Because I bet he was at least checking out the jig. Real pretty cutthroat. Sorry about that, buddy. Okay. Oh, there he goes. I think it was a tiger. Could have been a cut, but... I think it was a tiger. Oh. Yeah, I thought it was just in the weeds. Uh, no. It's not terrible. Looks like another cut. Okay, come here, buddy. Yeah, I thought it was just weeds. The cuts aren't really thumping it. A pretty low cut falls victim to the marabou jig. He's talking, yep. Okay, I'm giving him a drink right here. See if he can take off in this piece. Okay, good, he can. See you, buddy. Oh, good, good, good. Still got him? 
finally got one hooked up, Evan. Ooh, that's a nice tiger. You want me to go? The net's kind of far away, huh? You want me to run and grab the net for you? Dude, that's a good tiger. Is it? Oh, I thought it was a tiger. I've got glasses on. Oh, no, it's a big cut. You're right. Holy shoot, that's a big old cutthroat. Uh -uh. Dude, I'm gonna, you want the net. Do you want me to grab him for you? Is that better? Here. Okay, easy, easy. Okay. Grab his tail here. Dude, got him. Dude, good cutthroat. Good cutthroat trout. That thing's a tank. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I took a few. Get this out. Get a video up close of him real quick. Oh, okay. So I'm trying to get a cool release with it, but slimy suckers. Yeah, that was a that was a solid petty. Nice work, dude. Alrighty, folks, and that is a wrap out here today. Gonna finish it up here. The beautiful mountain here behind us in the lake. Um, we're still gonna be fishing, but I'm gonna put that in a different video so this one doesn't keep dragging out. So if you wanna watch that, be sure to stay tuned for that upload. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching this episode so much. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit the like button down below and subscribe if you guys haven't already. That way you can stay tuned for next episode of Lip Ripping Outdoors. As always, guys, tight lines, and I'll catch you later.